What's up all my stock markets, it's Shadon. I'm back again with another Cash App Investing video. Today I'm gonna to be sharing three stocks that are going to be on the rise in my portfolio. Y'all know I don't usually share my portfolio. I don't like to talk about my portfolio. I usually just like to share stocks, stocks that should be on your watch list. But today, I want this video to be a little bit more interactive. So I'm gonna share some of my stocks that are in my portfolio that I think are, is on the rise. And I would hope that anybody that's watching, if you're investing in the market, please, in the comments, let's make this interactive video. I wanna try this out. Share some stocks in your portfolio that you think is on the rise. I share, you share. That's how we learn and that's how we grow. Right now, before I get there, before I get to the stocks, I do want to appreciate you. Yes, you, you for watching. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you from the bottom of my heart. Make sure you hit the thumbs up on this video though, and subscribe if you haven't, because you know I really work hard on these videos. I be staying up late, losing sleep, just to share information and, and, and pass as much as I can along. Because if I win, you win. If you win, I win. That's my. That's that's how I like to look at it. I want us all to win. And that's why I got the stocks group chat going right now. And if you're interested in being a part of that, shoot me a DM above. Just know that there is a small, 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 small subscription fee to join the group chat. And maybe you're thinking out there, well, why am I gonna pay for that? Listen, I already give out enough content for free. I can't be doing, giving out information. Listen, I can't, I can't feed you. I'm bringing the food to the table. I can't feed you. You got to feed yourself. So if, they, if you got to pay a small fee to get information and, and advice and videos earlier than everybody else so that you can make more money, a small sub subscription fee is going to be nothing. You're going to make that back in my eyes because you're going to get information from people from all over that is going to help you gain money. And you can ask. You can ask questions to people that are doing research on a day-to-day -day basis. So if you're interested, shoot me a DM above and I will get you the information to be part of the generational wealth building group that we got going right now. Let's get to the business. I got three stocks in my portfolio and I'm not gonna talk about the obvious ones that I just picked up, Tesla and Apple. I'm not talking about that. They've caught enough press, but shout out to all my people that have caught, picked up some Tesla and Apple. I have a handful of investors, man that hit me up this week and you know I'm just happy that you know just building with people and love to talk about how we we all finna be winning uh, sooner than later because of these investments that we are making I'm gonna talk about some other stocks maybe some that people aren't talking about the first one is Outfront Media you drive by a billboard every time you go to your friend's house you go to work you go out to eat you go here you go there there is a billboard somewhere somehow Next time you drive by one, look up at the name. See what you see. You might see out front media. Now, I picked them to talk about it today because advertising is 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 down compared to last year. You know, during a recession, usually a lot of companies pull back on their advertising. So for me, that seems like a great time to get in. Um, they've been on a little rise, but if the economy seems to pull back some more, you could see a nice little pullback that will even leave a bigger opportunity. I'm gonna double down. I already, I already own. I'm gonna double down on our front media if they seem to pull back, and even if they don't, I'm going to continue uh, working on building my shares throughout time um, because that's just my strategy. So I'm not telling you to invest in these stocks. I'm telling you to do your research and see if this stock should fit in your portfolio. There's opportunity. But you gotta see it too, and it has to make sense for you. Just know that there's billboards everywhere. Outfront Media got billboards everywhere. So eventually, companies are gonna get back to going, and they're gonna want to have these billboards displaying their brands. That's just how it works. Once we get out this recession, hopefully soon. The next stock I'm gonna talk about is Canopy Growth. By market cap, they are the largest cannabis company by market cap. And what I like about them is that they're not in America. So if you have any doubts about uh, you know, the economy in America, uh, this Canopy Growth is in Canada. And they seem to be doing great. They're backed by an amazing company called Constellation Brands. Do your research. Very powerful, powerful, powerful company. So they got the budget. They got funding. So I don't really see them going anywhere. 
Recently, they've decided to open 10 new stores in Canada. Business must be doing well. They're going to hire 100 more new people. Everybody loves a company that's hiring new people. Do your research. I really have a good feeling about canopy growth, especially if the federal government maybe one day allows maybe some special permit for a company like this to come in and just do, your, do their thing, and then it'll be available just as easy as liquor is available to the people in America. So do your research on canopy growth. There's other cannabis companies out there that may be okay. Don't invest in Aurora Cannabis. Trust me. Uh, if you're going to invest in cannabis, I would say either Tilray or Canopy, but do your research. You ain't hearing from me. Now, lastly, I saved the best for last. I saved the best for last. And I saved the best for last because it's a little expensive. But it's very powerful technology that I'm going to talk about right now. So listen up. Qualcomm, leading 5G company. I'm going to say it again. Qualcomm is the leading 5G company. A lot of distractions have been coming. Um, distracting us from the fact that 5G is on its way. It will be the fastest technology on earth for now. Until the next thing gets made up. But yes, I am, I've been invested in Qualcomm for quite some time now. My money has doubled. But I'm still punching myself in the head because I wish I would have I wish I would have put all my money into Qualcomm. I wasn't thinking at the time. But 5G hasn't fully rolled out yet. There's still some time before it gets there. And I know Qualcomm is a powerful company because they've won lawsuits against some of your favorite biggest brands. Guess you guessed it. Apple and Tesla. They beat Apple out on a lawsuit that Apple was trying to get them. Tesla was trying to get the FDA or Federal Trade Commission, FDC, sorry, the, F, the FDC to pull back on the decision that was, that was made allowing Qualcomm to continue to do business how they do business. Listen, they got some strong contracts that they're putting together to make sure that their technology, that their work is being protected. And that's why I think it makes them a strong, strong company. Like I said, they're a little expensive. They're a little bit over a hundred bucks, but this is technology that is going to make our world faster, bring everything quicker to us. And it hasn't fully been rolled out yet. There's a lot of distractions. People are worrying about Tesla. They're worrying about Apple, but little do they know that these companies, they're probably going to need Qualcomm. Unless they get mad and fight a competitor that can work as good as Qualcomm. But Qualcomm is the leader. They are the leading 5G company. So they're going to need this technology to make their technology faster. Think about that. Right? These brands that everybody's buying into are going to need this technology so that their technology is faster. I'm gonna leave it. I'm gonna leave that one at that, so you can think about that a little bit. You know, I don't like to give too much. I give you a little bit, but you gotta do your own research and see if that this company fits in your portfolio. As always, I appreciate everybody for watching. If you're still here watching, thank you, thank you, thank you. Make sure you let me know in the comments if you're still here watching. I gotta start giving prizes for people that make it to the end of the video. Some sort of prize. Let me know what type of prize I should give in the comments. If you're still watching, let me know what type of prize I should start giving for the people that really, really show love. Make sure you hit the thumbs up on this video. Subscribe if you haven't. I will check y'all out tomorrow. And don't forget to put some of your stocks that you think is on the rise in the comments below so that we can share this information like we're supposed to do. Take it easy, y'all.